In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create some really nice uh, sort of visuals to go over your music. Uh, that's just typical music, uh, not anything made for visualization on an oscilloscope, but um, just something that you've already made and want to make maybe like a music video or visuals for. Um, so I've opened up an audio file here uh, and created a new project in Reaper. Um, and I've also gone and added the uh, Saucy audio plugin uh, to the track that I've got the audio file on. If I play this, um, this audio file, uh, just to show you what sort of some of the capabilities that uh, Saucy can do, is just simply in mono. And so uh, what that would look like on a real oscilloscope is what you see here. Um, it's just a boring straight line. Um, we can immediately go in and change some of these settings to make that look a lot less boring and more interesting. So if I enable this stereo effect, you're gonna start to see like proper visuals come out of the back of it. Um, and then you can go and dig into some of these other settings to change the color, change the sort of saturation of the image. Uh, you can make it black and white. You can make it really strong and intense. Um, and then there's some more advanced sort of like light effects. So this persistence controls how long it displays on this, uh, stays on the screen for rather. Uh, the glow effect, which changes how bright that looks. And then the afterglow is kind of telling you, you sort of see these sort of like artifacts here of how long the uh, image is sort of staying around for. Other bits like overexposure is just gonna change what that, how bright the brightest point is. If you change this all to zero, it's gonna look a lot more sort of muted. Some more like video based effects as well. You can add a bit of noise to make it a little bit more like film grain looking. Um, and then also some line effects. We've already messed around with the stereo already, um, but you can also do things like smoothing to make the lines look a bit more smooth, less jagged. Uh, and finally, some more um, practical effects. So you can change this to be more of a uh, sweep looking effect. So this is more of what you would see on a, uh, an oscilloscope by default, not in the XY mode. There's also some different screen overlays you can choose from here. Uh, if I go on empty, you won't get that um, sort of graphical that's appearing in the background. Um, you can also go on some like real oscilloscope looking ones. So these have uh, a nice sort of like realistic glow. If I turn up the glow a lot, you're gonna see that reflected on the edges here. And just turn the sweep off again. And then turn up stereo so you can kind of get a cool looking effect. Finally, there's a vector display mode. Again, this is just another realistic looking uh, oscilloscope screen. Brilliant. Um, I just want to show you as well, if I make this a, uh, if I go to settings and make this normal, so it's in stereo, you're going to see that sounds a little bit better. And if I disable the stereo effect now, you will start to see the uh, visuals as they would look like on a, on a real oscilloscope. Hopefully that gives you a nice overview of what you can do uh, very quickly with Saucy to make nice visuals on your audio. Thanks everyone for watching.